coronaviruses are a family of viruses um, that range from the common cold to MERS coronavirus, which is Middle East Respiratory Syndrome coronavirus, and SARS, Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome coronavirus. Coronaviruses are circulating in animals, and some of these coronaviruses have the capability of transmitting between animals and humans. We call that a spillover event. So coronaviruses typically cause respiratory symptoms, so uh, we recommend uh, basic hand hygiene such as washing your hands with soap and water and respiratory hygiene uh, such as when you sneeze, sneezing into your elbow. Ways to protect yourself against a potential animal source uh, would be to avoid unnecessary, unprotected contact with live animals um, and to make sure that you wash your hands thoroughly after contact with an animal and also to make sure that your meat is cooked thoroughly before consuming. There are no specific treatments for coronaviruses, but symptoms can be treated. This is an infectious virus that's never been seen in humans before. China is battling a new and rapidly spreading respiratory virus. L'emergenza uh, del virus simile alla SARS. A Wuhan, cette ville de 10 millions d'habitants au centre du pays. And it can kill. We know it's a type of coronavirus and it can infect our lungs. Like common colds and flu, it seems that it can spread person to person by coughing and sneezing. The main symptoms include difficulty breathing, fever and coughing, but it can lead to organ failure, pneumonia, and death. Because it's new, there's no vaccine or treatment currently that can stop it. The only way to prevent it is to avoid close contact with those who might be sick or carrying it. So it started in China, in a city called Wuhan, where hundreds of people fell sick. Experts are still trying to work out how the outbreak began exactly and how big a threat it is. They say an animal may have been the source of the virus and it's been linked to people visiting a local market. Many airports are screening people to stop the virus traveling further. There's still a lot we don't know yet, but experts say there's more to come from this epidemic and containing it quickly is the priority.